It's been nearly one year since Marlin asked us to help find her father. And after two months of searching, we found him in Marawi City. And at the time, Marlin had told us she had never seen the beach before. So if you remember, myself and Leah May arranged for Marlin to go down and see the beach. Now, nearly one year on, we catch up with Marlin and see how she's going. How are you? Hello, Mr. Blair. I'm okay. I'm fine. <laughs> are you at the house? Yes, alone. Alone? Where's, still a where's your mama? Church. Oh, it's a Sunday. She's at church. Oh, a good woman. Yeah, not home yet. How have you been since we saw you last? Ah, uh, yeah. Well, I'm I'm okay. My family is okay, so I'm fine. Yeah, good. sometimes. Yeah, sometimes good, sometimes stress. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> I've got some questions for you. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay. So since we saw you last, you had just um, been reunited with your father. How is that going? Are you chatting with him? Yes, uh, since we since that day, uh, we're uh, constantly talking on phone and yeah, um, mostly uh, almost every day like that in the morning and the evening like that, wow. you know, and then, oh yeah, but um, I think uh, September. At this point, Marlin told us about an issue that she's having with her father's wife. So this is not Marlin's biological mother. The father has remarried. And next up, you'll hear in Marlin's own words what the wife has been doing. Um, times that my my father said, tell me that she throw his phone. Oh, okay. And it broke, so she, so he need to buy. Oh. A new one. Right. It's actually really sad because this lady that you're looking at, she had not seen her father since she was just a baby. She's calling, she's calling me every time, and so I asked her that where is my father because right. yeah, that's like She said that she's not, uh, he's not here. So she, uh, he's somewhere like that or working, and then so I said, okay. Uh, uh, just call me back when he's home. Yes. Was, yeah. Every time she's calling at me, and I, exp I, I thought it was him, my father. But right. Yeah, but it's her, the wife. How is your wheelchair? Is it still working? No problem. Oh yeah, yeah, it's still working. Okay. I, I'm still using it. Yeah, every day. What else has been happening in your life? Have you had any uh, people reach out to you through your YouTube channel? Have you made any new friends? Yeah, there were a few. Would you like to share with us? Because I think maybe there was a couple of people asking for your... They kept asking me, Blair, can I contact Marlin? She is so pretty. not sure about them I, maybe just they were just joking or young but i don't yeah no love <laughs> no love <laughs> you're still waiting yeah <laughs> just friends <laughs> right but at least you have a lot yeah. of friends now now you have a lot of pen pals you have oh, a lot yeah, of internet yeah. friends you have a lot of sotors yeah i'm yeah, I'm thankful. Back last year, myself and Leah May spent quite a few days with Marlin and we're quite good friends, so we can actually tease her about this. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> it's okay. Because so many people comment and ask, is, yes. is, is, uh, Marlin, still available? is Marlin still available? Is she single? And I'm like, I'm not too sure. <laughs> so I'm, we're hearing it live and direct from Marlin now. Marlin, are you still single and ready to mingle? <laughs> I think that's the best we're going to get, guys. <laughs> she's got that big, beautiful smile. And uh, she's, I think she's being a little bit coy. She's not giving too much away. 
like a good girl should. She's not giving too much away. So it's really nice to catch up with you again, Marlin. We're so happy for you that you've made contact with your father. Um, it's understandable that there might be a little bit of conflict with your father's family. Maybe there's a little bit of jealousy creeping in there. But at least you've made contact with him after all of these years. You know where he lives. You know he's alive. You, you're contacted through him on Facebook. So at least you can chat with him. Yes, thank you also, uh, Mr. Blair and Miss Leia. <laughs> yeah. You're welcome. This, this moment, this time. You're welcome. <laughs> So, we, so you are more, so I can see that you are more happy and yes. gloomy. Yes. Yes. Oh, sorry. Oh, thank you. How old are you, you now? How old are you now, Marlin? Oh, no, I, I'm old. <laughs> I'm 37. Well, you're 37. You look 37. like... You look like 27. Oh, you. Oh. Yeah, so it's great to catch up with you. We're so happy for you, Marlin. Yes. And when we come to um, Mindanao, Kagandioro, yeah. we'll catch the ferry. Can we come and say hello? Uh, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much also. Uh, yes, anytime. Mr. Anytime. Blair, Ms. Leia. We'll okay. catch up with you soon, Marlin. Thank you for taking the time to let the viewers know how you've been. Thank you so much, Mr. Blair. Thank Thank you. Take care. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. I'm sorry about the signal, guys, with Globe Telecom, but it was next we were calling Rosie. And Rosie and Michelle had reached out to us last year, asking us to find a chap called Mike Robinson. There's Rosie. And we did. After a couple of months, we actually found Mike Robinson. And now we're going to chat with Rosie, find out how she's getting along. I just like woke up. I'm just like so tired. I was like doing uh, some partying last night. No. Did you go out last night? No, I mostly stayed home. Mm. I watched documentaries, so I slept like two in the morning. What's the latest with you and your mum? Uh, we're doing good. Thank you for asking. And I know I'm kind of be like far away, but I keep communicating her every day. So. <laughs> Just so the viewers know that your mum is in South Cebu, in Naga, mm -hmm. and you're in Lapu yeah. Lapu. You're living in Lapu Lapu. Yes, I am right okay. now. <laughs> right, and uh, you've got a part-time job just helping um, a young woman PWD person with disability. Yeah. Is that right? So you're like a, yeah. a a home carer. Yes, I do. Mike Robinson, your grandpa, he came over in October, was it? Was it October? Last year. Yes, last, last year. year. For and two weeks. Wow. You guys. And now he went back, but he's due back in Easter. Yes, that was like the plan, but a moment he's going to be like healing. Right. So, mm -hmm. When you say healing, what do you mean? Um, he was like in the hospital for like two days now because of um, swelling feet. Swelling feet? So, yeah, swelling feet. I think the um, um, big uncle Carlos said it was like um, dry skin that he keeps like scratches. Oh, dear. So it was like, uh, you know, um, how do I say this? Like, um, it's like being infected or been like having an infection. Oh, it was infected, was it? Yes, yes, it is. Is he out of hospital or is he still in hospital now? Uh, no, not yet. Not uh, yet. It's like healing. Okay. He's still in healing. Oh, dear. Uh, not too serious? No, not really. He's a staff guy. <laughs> <laughs> he is. Even used to it. He's a staff guy. He is a staff guy. That's why I love him. He's very really <laughs> tough. Uh, but he was due to be coming at Easter. Well, that was, that's the plan. Yes, that's the plan. And yeah. How long? We will be like preparing. We will like preparing all, all of the stuff in America. So we will be like having a freely time in the Philippines in the second time. <laughs> How has your mum been since she first met her father? How has have you noticed any changes in her? That she's happier now. That she's actually found him. 
Yeah, so much. So I feel like just like you know, she's like been like blooming woman. Really. <laughs> and now she's like taking like um alternative learning school again, just like to finish her high school. Wow. So I'm really proud of mom. Oh, wow, that's <laughs> she awesome. Really, like she's excelling herself. Far out. <laughs> She is. She is right now. Been changes of her, like not not like like the world that gonna be like giving to you, but like deep inside of her, it's like blooming of her. Wow. You. She's got that closure now that what the piece that was missing has finally been found, and she's whole again. Yeah, she is. She is so much, which is I'm really, you know, Mama is kind of be like a secretive woman, but yes. you know, it's like she, it's it's more and more now um, opening herself, which is like I'm really proud of her. Yeah, and a, another little story that will tell the viewers that myself and Leah May was contacted by a lady in uh, South Philippines in Mindanao. Who your mum? Yeah. Your mum used to be the nanny for their family when she was like a teenager, and the woman said that she had been trying to find your mum for decades. She carried her picture of your mum and your grandmother in her purse, hoping one day that she would be able to find your mum again. And then she saw the video and she reached out to us. And said, "This yeah. is this is the Michelle Robinson that I've been trying to find. She was my, um, what was she like a a helper or a yeah. a carer as well for the family? Yeah. Did she make contact, Rosie? Yeah. Yes. Um, she, no, she like contact Mama, and I saw her in like in a message request, and I said to her like, Mom, there's like a message of you, and she said like, what message? And you just like look it up." <laughs> Wow. And Auntie Anne, Auntie Anne just like contact her and they'd be like crying. I just like give her a moment. <laughs> oh, wow. So she contact her name's Anne and she contacted uh, your mom. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. They've been like talking a lot. And yeah, mama is like having experience in life, which is like, you know, she, yeah. she's uh, been like said, she's like strict woman, but she doesn't wow. have a good heart. She has a good heart. So from <laughs> just that, like my grandma. From that video, there was somebody else that was looking for your mum. So your mum was looking for your grandfather, Mike, but there was a woman yeah. in Mindanao looking for your mum. <laughs> yes, yes. It so. was like, you know, it's 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 like a blessing and like for, for the family and yeah. us. And thank you. It was like, I don't know. No, I don't know that there's like people out there like love my mom yeah. so yeah. much for past decades you know i'm i'm yeah. so i'm so happy i'm so happy she must have left uh, a lasting I'm, I'm impression yeah because she promised yeah. she promised uh and promised her mom uh when she her mom died and saying like i promise you mom i'm gonna find uh how, what's the, how she called your mother <laughs> Huh? Gigi. Oh, oh. Ati Gigi. 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 She promised her mom. She promised her mom. It's like a dying wish that can you find this Gigi uh, even if I passed away. And then since then she carrying all the pictures and ev every time she go like so sorry girl. She's carrying the picture of your mom hoping that she will find your mom and then she saw the video wow she saw the yeah, video I know, and reached out I know. to us like, yeah. it was like nationwide yeah. i know yeah. it's like international <laughs> <laughs> has anyone recognized you when you've gone out has anyone said you're the girl from the video no 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 <laughs> thank god no no I, i'm more like into like no there's no i'm gonna be like ghost and a stranger you like, like, no, i've been like <laughs> rooming around <laughs> <laughs> you like to keep your head down Yes, yes. Mm. Thank God, no one recognized me yeah, that way, it, Mom. <laughs> it, it reached a million views already. Yeah, your YouTube. video at the airport's got a million views of your wow. mom. Yeah. So on a personal level, uh, myself and Leah May are good friends with you now. And we, we've been yeah. out with you a few times. So we've become quite close with you and we're good friends. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we've, we've seen yes, we each other. We've seen each other with a few drinks inside us and we're singing karaoke at the bar. So we've had some good times together. <laughs> but, so, you know, it's it, it all like in a line of miracles of everything, sir. And it's 
thank you thank you so yeah. much so thank you rosie for catching up with us and letting the viewers know how you are and how your mum is yeah and, yes and thank how you so much yeah you're welcome <laughs> yeah and i see you soon guys again. okay mm. of course, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah we will like we will again we, you know we will paint the town red again okay rosie we'll let you go <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye for now. Bye.